In this video, we will discuss the elements of identity management as well as best practices when implementing. For the purposes of this video, we will be specifically focusing on the functionality of simplified ID merge. If you are on an older version of identity management, please refer to the provided documentation in the written portions of this section. To identify the version of identity management your team is utilizing, please navigate to your project settings page in Mixpanel and select the Identity Merge tab. As users navigate through your website or application, it is common for them to move from anonymous to identified states, as well as logged out to logged in states. When utilizing SDKs, especially client-side, it is important to manage all the identifiers belonging to a user correctly to ensure that all of their pre-auth and post-auth activity is tracked as one user. First, let's discuss the various elements of identity management and what they refer to. It is important to remember that all IDs in Mixpanel are case sensitive. Device ID is a random hash we assign a user through our client side SDKs. This ID gets stored locally or in the Mixpanel cookie and is how we keep track of an anonymous user's activity. User ID is the ID you assign to the user as a means of identifying them. This value should be something along the lines of an internal ID or database ID and should never change for a user once applied to them. Distinct ID is an identifier set by Mixpanel based on the combination of device ID and user ID. The purpose of distinct ID is to provide a single unified identifier for a user across all devices and sessions. Identity cluster. An identity cluster refers to a cluster of the various IDs assigned to a single user across their entire life. Identity clusters will have a canonical ID that should be equal to the user ID that you have passed for a user. Some best practices that your team should follow when implementing identity management are, if you believe that many of your users will be sharing devices, we recommend calling reset at logout. The reset call will clear Mixpanel data from a user's browser cookies or local storage so that the next time someone returns from that device, they will initially be treated as a new user and assigned a new random device ID. You should avoid creating anonymous user profiles and only call identify when the user is known or logged in. You should call Mixpanel identify upon a, a successful signup or login, but you should also call identify when an app is reopened or foregrounded in a logged in state. This is especially important if you want to set user properties for a user as the identify call is a necessary call to make during a user session to set user profile properties on their profile. If you are setting your own device ID, for example, from a server-side SDK, best practice is to set the ID in a UUID v4 format. And for implementations not leveraging a client-side SDK, ensure that every event is sent with a distinct ID or the components that make up distinct ID, such as device ID and or user ID. You can read more context on these best practices in the written portions of this section. If you have any questions on identity management, check out our docs, leave a comment, or join our Slack community. Thanks for watching.